flashback to the 80s. Yes, another review from the 80s. A film I have not seen until yesterday. Hospital Massacre, 1982. While receiving a routine checkup, a beautiful woman is stalked by a maniac out to avenge a childhood Valentine's Day humiliation. Directed by Boaz Davidson. Written by Mark Bem and Boaz Davidson. Released April of 1982. Tagline, There's no recovery at Hospital Massacre. Here's the cast. Barbie Benton as Susan Jeremy. Charles Lucia as Harry. John Van Ness as Jack. John Warner Williams as Dr. Saxon. Den Searles as Dr. Beam. Gloria Jean Morrison as Nurse Dora. Karen Smith as Nurse Kitty. Michael Frost as Ned. And Jimmy Strathis as Tom. And the cast goes on. Here's one of these old school, early 80s cheese horror films. I love cheese. And what I find fascinating about this movie and other hospital horror films in the 80s is the smoking in the hospital. I can remember that, by the way. Smoking in their rooms. Compared to now, where it's everything smoke-free, it's just pretty cool to see some old 80s stuff that wasn't uh, found very serious like they are today with the cancer in the cigarettes. Very interesting film. You know, you have the Halloween movies that started off, you know, the hospital get-up. Not totally, but, you know, you get my point. And Halloween 2 starts off in the hospital in 81. So the hospital has uh, found its way into the 80s cheese horror films. With slashers, anyways. Um, well, again, when I say cheese, I love the 80s cheese films. Hospital Massacre is about a girl named Barbie Benton, which, you know, she used to be a Playboy bunny, I think, if I ain't mistaken. She just goes to the hospital for a routine checkup. Her doctor is Dr. Jacobs. But the movie starts off with uh, her as a kid. I'm assuming it's her brother. I, they don't get in detail. And then there's this kid that's outside of the house looking in that uh, knocked on the door and left her a Valentine's Day card, and she laughs at him. He gets humiliated, so you know the idea is, okay, this is going to be a revenge film from uh, when they were kids, but you didn't know who it was. So you follow the story, and then uh, this person keeps changing her medical records where the other doctors think she's seriously ill and so forth and so forth. So I don't want to go into too much detail. But there's a killer in the loose, and you find out who it is. And there's some cool kills in this movie. You know, for it being 82 and being somewhat of a, you know, mid range budget, uh, very cool film. I liked it. I never saw it. Again, Hospital Massacre. It's also known as X Ray. I think that was the alternate title. But a very, very interesting, cool film. Well shot, well acted. You know, it's a neat storyline. I love the 80s films, and uh, this movie can uh, pass for today. It can still make it. Enough said. This is Grissom Herzog. I give this film a 7 out of 10. It's a typical early 80s slasher film in a hospital. Um, beautiful women, drunks, smoking. It's all fun. This is Grissom Herzog, and I'm out of here.